Assalamu alaikum viewers, welcome to my channel Genome Wide Study. If you are new on my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon. So you will get the notification of all the new videos. In this video, we will do the multiple sequence alignment of the protein sequences in two cluster W in mega 7 and then edit and do the shading of that protein alignment into a beautiful color through gene doc software. So let's start. First, you need to open the file of protein sequences and then select all copy open the mega align edit build alignment create a new alignment ok and protein and then paste the sequence and then do the alignment double press on w align protein and then ok When the process finished, then save that alignment. Go to data, export alignment and save in pasta format. Into your destination folder that in the genome study I made a folder alignment and then save that file align in pasta format. Save. Now open the gene dog software. You can down easily download it from the Google. It is freely available software you can download it from the Google and then install it. If you feel any difficulty in downloading or installing then let me know I will do some help for you. After opening that uh, software go to file import and then click on import find your uh, file that you have saved in pasta format and then done. So it will show that this black shows the 100% amino acids. There are four different colors in the alignment like black, light and white depending upon the percentage of amino acids in the sequences. So you can use them as it is but to make it beautiful you can make them in different colors and also in one line the number of amino acid you can also change for changing the amino acid number click on this C and then here how many amino acids you want in one line for example I am keeping 90 amino acid in one line and then here from here you can change the size of that amino acid 14 and here the it is normal either or bold and if you didn't need the consensus that you didn't want this so then they are click on no consensus and okay so you will get like this you can also change the color by clicking on that C and go to shade here you also change their percentage that which percentage they show the 100% similarity that the second one is 75% and third one is 50 or here like this one is 180, 60 like this how many layers you want and then from here you can change the color of background as well as the color of the amino acid by clicking here back so you can choose any color of your interest like this anyone you can change it or from there there are another different colors so and ok and this is the color of the background if you also want to change the color of amino acid then click on this four and you can change any one and then here you can also change the color of this one you can change it by your choice and make it beautiful. This shows the number of amino acids that how many amino acids are this one. So if you didn't want these also you can change them. Here click on that C and then here label and when you press the OK so that numbering of amino acid also disappears. In this way you can make it and edit it and also give a beautiful shape to 
make it beautiful then you need to save it how you save it you can click on this sign and then click on these lines alignment line alignment line one by one if you didn't want any section you can now click on it and then copy control c and open any file where you want to save it like uh, ppt or paint to make it in a figure form and this control is so in this way you can have the alignment of your protein sequences and then you can make some uh, edit it in different tools in which you have this command so this is our video about the protein alignment and its editing or shading thank you